Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And here I have a great article for you guys from Reuters. I will leave a link to it in the description in case you guys haven't seen it. So this is an older article, but something that I wanted to touch on because I think it's 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 a very critical time for Verizon to make this move. I think this is very important and it is needed. Verizon searching for new finance chief and potential CEO successor, Wall Street Journal reports. So... We all know, and this is no secret, Verizon's consumer uh, group has been, their, their growth has been, in some cases, stagnant, but for the last few quarters, they've been taking losses. And, you know, you can, you can pass the blame around, you can point fingers, but ultimately, I think the leader should be held accountable, which is Hans Vestberg. And... Yes, I know they they might be they might have reacted the first as a company to to certain situations like cutbacks and 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 moving over to MVNOs as they saw that in the, in the operational numbers, but they still have no competitive edge about them. This this new my plan is really just geared towards more more monetization if you add add a perk that's more money for Verizon that they make now. So there's nothing competitive about it. So the only two things that they are doing right now that or three things I should say that are that are somewhat positive is the fixed wireless access growth, the uh the business growth and then the MVNO growth. And the MVNO growth, I still see that as as a as a you know, 50-50 because that customer that was with Verizon, paying Verizon, Verizon prices, is now going to cable, and cable is paying Verizon for that customer 50, maybe even 60% less than that customer was paying Verizon directly. And if that continues to happen to where Verizon sheds even bigger share to cable, then it's going to eventually show in the bottom line. So right now it's a very critical juncture for for Verizon to make this move I feel. I, I I feel that this move still needs to be be made this year and they need some serious change. T-Mobile is only getting better. T-Mobile is only getting getting better at gaining perception. And and that's that's going to hurt Verizon's case as well. In the future as T-Mobile grows that network network even more as they add more density, as they start adding the small cells, they're going to get more confident. They're going to start going to these bigger business accounts with a lot of confidence, and they're and, and those people are going to test those networks, and they're they're going to say, "Wait a minute, I can get the same amount of network that I got before for less," and they're gonna they're gonna start biting on that, and that's going to hurt Verizon even more, and and that's. And that's just going to gradually happen with time. It's not going to happen all in one quarter or two quarters. It's going to happen over time where that's going to happen. And Verizon and, and T-Mobile has shown some success in doing that and AT&T as well. So Verizon is not shielded by any of this. They have to start being competitive. And I think right now is a critical time to do so. T-Mobile is getting ready to hit 300 million pops with 2.5. The network, the network is expanding from what I'm being told. So this is a very critical time for Verizon to make these moves. If not, they're digging themselves deeper in the hole. Just calling it what it is. Again, handing your customer over to your, your cable partner is, it, it's not going to work long term. It's just not going to work long term. You have to eventually start growing organically your base again. You have to start competitively taking customers back in bigger droves from T-Mobile and AT&T to, to grow your bottom line again. You have to do it. So let me know what you think about that in the comment section down below. Look forward to reading your comments. Make sure you guys stay tuned for more. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.